The migrant influencer who has been encouraging migrants to come to the United States illegally and squat in the homes of U.S. citizens has been on the run from immigration authorities, the Post has learned. Mi gente, he pensado invadir una casa en Junay State. Lionel Moreno, who is a Venezuelan national, crossed the southern border into Eagle Pass, Texas in April 2022. From there, he was enrolled on what is known as the Alternatives to Detention Program, which allows federal authorities to track migrants who enter the country illegally once they are released into the United States interior. Migrants who are enrolled in the program, like Moreno, are required to report to federal immigration authorities on their whereabouts in the United States while enrolled in the program. However, Moreno did not do that and was listed as an absconder from the program. Moreno regularly shares on social media how he scams the system to receive money from the federal government, food stamps, and shows his social security card in posts that we've reviewed. He claims that his wife and daughter receive $350 a month from the federal government, often flaunts the food and aid that they receive through the funding from these federal programs. Moreno originally told federal authorities that his intended address in the United States was the Catholic Charities Office in Miami. He has since been seen in posts in Columbus, Ohio. When Moreno failed to report to immigration authorities as part of the Alternatives to Detention Tracking Program, ICE in Miami did mail him his court date. In one social media post, Moreno said that he has been in the U.S. for over a year and has not had to work one day. He said, quote, I've concluded that the American dream is real. This is food of the best quality that they just give you. In a separate post, Moreno said, quote, work is for slaves, boys. Remember that work is for slaves. Where have you seen a millionaire work? Don't humiliate yourself. You have to be creative to ask for money, he said.